Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all honor, glory, and praise unto Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakak Kodash. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone for teaching us all this truth to rule well. I wanted to go into this being a part two. All right, Isaiah 33 and 6. And wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of thy times and strength of salvation. The fear of Yahweh is his treasure. All right, because we're entering into these times to where everything's going to be turned upside down. We're entering into these times to where the love of many shall wax worse and worse. Okay? We're entering into these times where Egyptian shall rise up against Egyptian. Okay? We're entering into times to where you, as a man of the Lord, have to shoot your shot. Okay? If you believe you're an Israelite, it's time to grow in spirit and faith and it works. Okay? So what you're supposed to be doing as a man of Yahweh Bashem Yahushai is presenting your body a living sacrifice. Okay? So I have this one right here, Matthew 4 and 17. From the time Yahweh Shai began to preach, to say, Repent, for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. And this is when Yahweh Shai was on the scene. Okay? When he walked the earth, okay, before he was glorified. You know? The time is at hand. This is Matthew 13 and 15. For this people's heart is waxed gross, and their ears are dull of hearing, and their eyes they have closed, lest at any time they should be with their eyes, they should see with their eyes and hear with their, their ears, and should understand with their heart, and should be converted, and I should heal them. So it's time for you to be converted. You know, like I made mention in part one, the brother was talking about um, women to shoot their shots, you know, because we're at the end. You see, we're already in that time, you know, and it's time for women to shoot their shots. OK, whether that means staying single and, and staying uh, singular, singularly uh, in, in the faith of Yahweh Hashem Yahushai. Or going after a man of the Lord that is single in the eye of Yahweh Bashem Yahushai, you know, doing the work, you know. And I wanted to make this video for, for, for the men, okay, to shoot their shot, okay, meaning, you know, take that advantage that you have, you know. Yahweh Bashem Yahushai gave you this wisdom, knowledge, understanding for a reason. And if you're sitting on this on this reason, Okay, on the salvation, then the Most High is just not going to save you. You see, Matthew 16 and 3. And in the morning, it will be foul weather today, for the sky is red and lowering. O ye hypocrites, ye can discern the face of the sky. Right? You have these weather channels and you have all these people that can discern just about anything that's going to happen. You know, the the polar uh, pole of this and then the moon is going to do this and there's going to be this and this and this is going to happen okay or people look up in the sky and they see clouds and oh it's going to rain right it says but ye cannot discern the signs of the times okay you go to uh, revelations chapter 3 and you go to the hour of temptation that word temptation when you go to the root word of the etymology of the word okay when you go to the root word it means to pierce Okay, so it's the hour of piercing. When's the hour of piercing? Right now. It's happening right now, right before your eyes. And people are looking at it as another thing. Right. People are looking at it as something that's, you know, uh, that's just normal. You see, just another daily visual. Okay. But the Most High gave us. This wisdom, knowledge, understanding to realize that what they're doing is the hour of temptation and people are being tempted to get pierced, man. You know, that's why people call it the jab. You know, when you jab something, you pierce something. OK, so it's the beginning of the, of the times of the end of the times, man. It's the last seconds, you know, and like it says in, in the book of Hebrews, um, uh, 
Yahweh Shai, or the Most High, who at sundry times spoke unto our fathers in the time past by the way of the prophets, in these last days has he spoken unto us by the Lord. Right? So the time of the Lord were the last days. That was the beginning of the last days. Okay? And now we're at the end. You see? So we're supposed to be fervent in spirit, shooting our shot, trying to get closer to Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. You see? So I just wanted to make this a quick video, making it a part two, because I was interrupted yesterday on the video that I was making, you know, just a couple minutes uh, that were left, you know, that I wanted to say that was on my spirit. So with that, I hope that was edifying. And with that, I want to give all honor, glory, and praise unto Yahweh Bahasham Yahweh Shai. Bahasham Rakakwadash. Shalom. You shoot your shot. Shalom.